This 97-minute film documents the various histories and playing styles of three of the most distinguished and accomplished guitarists in music history, as they all come together for a single night to collaborate with one another and discuss their music influences. Jimmy Page of Led Zeppelin, The Edge of U2, and Jack White of The White Stripes are these three influential guitarists. And even if you're only a fan of one of them, this movie has something in store for all lovers of rock music. Casual fans and viewers alike will be delighted and educated on the amazing tapestries that make up these guitarists' and musical histories. For diehard fans like myself, however, there was very little information in the first half of the movie that was really new to me. It was still a treat to hear these classic biographies from the musicians' mouths, however. Guggenheim does a beautiful job of relating these stories to us through the eyes of some of rock's biggest names all shot magnificently via a very effective fly-on-the-wall technique. While seeing these legends in their element and hearing their insight into guitar playing is a true treat, the real heart of this film is the central meaning of the three guitarists dubbed The Summit. This ongoing fourth narrative piece holds the film together, and in the final act of the movie when The Summit is given center stage, the movie really shines. No longer are we seeing these musicians tell us about their lives and history, we get to see a rare glimpse into seeing them share their skill and talent with each other. Watching The Edge explain the chord progressions to U2's I Will Follow to Page and White, for example, is a real delight. Sadly, this portion of the film is few and far between, and when the boys finally start to play a song together, it's under the film's ending credits. A magnificent and inspiring film, but sadly, for a diehard like myself, I definitely walked away wishing for much more footage of these guitarists interacting with one another. Well, that's what I thought of the movie. Now let's see what you guys had to say about It Might Get Loud in the YouTube comments. Shadowstar133 wrote, A decent movie. It was nice, but I wish they had had them play more music. Sure, some of us wonder about their pasts, but truthfully, it could have been great and I did not personally enjoy it much. Was okay. I'd give it a 4 out of 10. JNX94 wrote, I loved this movie. It was very well done and had some very interesting stories, but if you don't play guitar or like guitars, it could get boring. 8 out of 10. Now let's fire up the right matic to see how It Might Get Loud did. Alright, a 7-8 split. Now as I explained, I really liked this movie, but because I was a diehard fan, it didn't quite give me enough. I had to hold off on giving it an 8. Your guys' reviews were a bit mixed, but it averaged out to an 8. You guys scored it a great rating. 